road to Holland for um, a festival called Crosslinks. A lot of contemporary artists and string players join together to do interesting things. Uh, we're seriously late to try and get on this ferry. We've got four minutes. About five miles to go. Can we just explain? Uh, for the record, that if we don't get this ferry, there isn't another one in an hour or in a, a couple of hours. There isn't one until midday tomorrow, which means that we'd miss rehearsal. Yes! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I only would have done the whole tour. It wasn't important. And you're taking pictures. Tomorrow is going to be pretty decisive, really, because it means that we actually get to hear the act, the, the, the real thing. And um, we've got two half-day rehearsals, and then we're in there with the shows. Please welcome to stage the magnificent Miss Lou Rhodes. We had our first rehearsal in God knows how long. We were rehearsing pre-strings. And that'll all change when the strings get involved. Come and shine your light. We're in Amsterdam. And we'll take a trip to hell. We're about to rehearse with the Amsterdam Sinfonetta four or five gigs in Holland. And all the world will know. And all the world will know. Chip hop before. Chip hop. Yeah. Yeah, chip hop. <laughs> we're a very classical orchestra, so we're sort of uh, we're doing a lot of contemporary music as well as the classical things like Beethoven, Mozart, things like that. But uh, this is really something out of our normal league. expected them to have done quite a lot more of this kind of crossover stuff but they're very very in, in that classical sort of area so um, so it's definitely a clash of cultures Andy and I are just we're not classically trained in any sense of the word and so they're talking bar numbers and we're talking oh do you know when that chorus happens or when the drums come in or when, you know so it's like we're trying to speak in different languages about the same thing I think things like that can be really good because they, they, they bring the unexpected Good to be 
back to Thank you. It's like our second home, I think, this place. But this time it's extra special because we've got the wonderful, wonderful Amsterdam Sinfonietta with us here on stage. When you came along, your face was the song I'd forgotten to see. Look, for every classical musician, selling out the Paradiso and being on that stage is a wild experience. So, despite, you know, all the difficulties running up to the show, running up to the show, the show is going to be amazing. And they're all just going to be looking out. They're not used to what you're used to. There's no body else for me. No, no, no. Nobody else will do. No, 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 no. two hours before doors, so all sound checking has to happen then with the orchestra, when normally you'd have hours to do it. So yeah, we're up against it, but we are winning. Day 
something so magical fell from the sky. And all of the people they gathered. So guys, what we're going to do, we're just going to run a bit. So do you know where Bless the Day is? And I, I can fly at 45. I can fly. Initially when we were asked to do this, the obvious ones were the ones that were quite string-tastic already. Goretzky yeah. and Gabriel. I can shine even in the darkness. My job is to use acoustic instruments on music that doesn't really necessarily call for that. Seeing a symphonic orchestra or seeing anything and knowing that whatever, you played a clarinet and that's cool and I played a piano and that's cool, but together it makes this noise, you know, boom.
I have a, a deep love with the classical sounds and that with the electronic mix really it does it for me, it gives me goosebumps. Wrapped in the warmth of you, loving every breath of you. I think what's so special about Lamb songs is obviously you have loose, unique voice and these electronic beats and John's bass. The combination is just really special, especially when you see them live. The energy is really up to the roof. Lamb was the first concert I've ever been to. It was in 1999. 1999, that's yeah. nice. Yeah, it's memories from the past. So Go Recky is something I will be hoping for this evening. Who doesn't? Goreki for me is um, the best uh, love song I, I hear. It's, yes, it's really, really touching, yeah. All this time I've loved you And never known your face All this time I've missed you And such this human race Stops turning Gonna love you till the seas run dry I found the world I waited for the world I waited for Let's